Hello, this is my day three video update for my Hungarian learning project or uh, Magyar Niel. And so where I'm at right now is I've been studying in drops for three days and my goal for today was to get into the learning dojo, which I did. So I've learned my first 50 words in Hungarian and today I'm going to demonstrate the learning dojo in drops. I'm going to be using it for the first time. I haven't used it for any other languages yet, so I'm pretty excited about that. I worked really hard to get into the dojo by day three. Some of the other things that I've been doing, I wrote my first introduction script in Hungarian. I'm currently getting it corrected. I had my very first chat in Hungarian, a written text chat. And of course, I've been doing daily vocabulary study on drops. So now I can say things like Sia, um, Kusunum, I think. <laughs> uh, what else can I say? Oh, Talakazum, my favorite word. Igen, Nem, and a few other words. And I've also gone ahead and have scheduled my very first face-to-face -face chat in Hungarian. I have a friend who I'm going to chat with online, so I'll try to record part of that conversation. I have almost two months still to continue preparing for the trip to Hungary, so I'm really looking forward to seeing where it goes and um, how learning a language so vocabulary focused works. I've always put an emphasis on vocabulary. But this is the first time where it's really going to be about 90% of the work that I'm doing. And I think it's going really well. So I look forward to seeing what that looks like in two months. I am finally in the Language Drops Dojo and I am so excited. This is going to be the first time that I get to test this out. And these are gonna be words that I haven't practiced since yesterday and that I've gotten wrong a lot. So expect lots and lots of mistakes. Sia. So one of the things that I said earlier is that I was working on pronunciation. Beszélek. Beszélek. But I noticed that as I learn with drops and I hear the pronunciation and then I repeat it, es. I'm kind of picking it up naturally and I think this is working better for me than if I spend a lot of time Lány. trying to just work on the pronunciation isolated. This gives me a lot Lány. of context of the sounds within words. Ooh, 98% accuracy, 37 words. It looks like it gives me a more diverse selection of words. Just to give you an idea of some of the words that I've learned so far, I've learned the entire essentials category. I've learned a couple numbers, I've learned emotions, I've learned pronouns. One of the things that I still am kind of missing is the accents on words like uvi, uvi and u. Uh. I think I'm getting them wrong sometimes and I don't think it's because I don't know which is which. I think sometimes when I'm looking at them in the app I can't really see the difference when I'm trying to do it fast in the five minutes so I make mistakes. And then even when I hear them I don't hear that big of a difference between the two. I'm sure I'll pick that up later though so I'm not super worried about it. And so I've learned possessives as well as pronouns. I've started to work on nationalities from here, just to give you an idea of what I'm going to work on going forward. So I'm really working on this foundation category, but then I'm gonna focus down here on this business and tech category. So it looks like I've learned 58 words so far in Hungarian out of 1,663 that are available for this language. And my personal record is 109 words. I'm feeling pretty good about that considering that it's day three. And I would say that my recollection of these words at this point is mostly passive. So when I see them or hear them, I understand them. But if I were to try and come up with them on my own at this point, in most cases, I probably wouldn't be able to do it. But that's something that will get better with practice. And it's definitely something that I'm going to work on. That's where I'm at. And I will be back probably the day that I have my conversation. So I will see you then. Thanks.